the most charming. The nat natural laws are such that we have physical constants. They're so precise in the way to control and order our universe. Yes. So it is not just a coincidence to say, you know, this gravitational constants, the Planck's constant, all these constants to, in so many decimal places in their position. If such a system exists, there must be a reason why it has been designed. So the only way we can know this, the purpose of our existence, we can't know it by our individual speculation because I can speculate and say the reason of my existence is just to, you know, cycle. My life, whole life, I should just cycle. That's my purpose of existence. And you may agree with me because you're all the cyclists. Someone say no, just to eat chocolates. So individual speculation. I don't know. So individually speculating about it. Yeah. It's not going to lead us to the absolute reason why we are created, why we are designed. No, but I mean, if somebody had designed this, some thing or some being, or whatever, why didn't they design that 500 years ago? Why did they wait till 100 years ago to design it, or, or about 30, it is, it is, 30 years ago to design that? It is possible why that our, design, so our designer has given us, human beings, the faculty of intellect, That's true. knowledge and wisdom, in which we can grow and develop ourselves to continuously to improve in our designs, in our products and so on. Okay? That's how the human life is there. It's not like a static, boring life in which you're given all of this together in one plate and that's it. Possibly, I don't know. But that's what we can observe and infer from looking at the universe. I would say, and I'm sure you could agree with me, there cannot be more than one designer for our universe. There cannot be one, more than one un designer for our universe. He's a heckler. He's a heckler. Have a, have, have a go with this guy. He, he's a heckler. Can hear, yeah. He will come and start heckling. And he will just talk on my ears. The child so, I have to get going. Have to go? I've got to make dinner for my kids. No worries. You take I, care. I'm a bit but late. The one, what I wanted to talk about, I I know, no, no, I'm going to go. I, no, no, I, I will agree let, with you. What I'm is saying. That it's amazing. What I'm saying. And I don't know the as, answer. To, I don't know the answer. To as a Muslim, mm. we have intellectual reasons to believe that God, our creator, designer exists yeah. and our creator, designer is absolutely one. Since communication is a form of guidance and since or raises up agents called prophets and messengers to guide us, yeah. don't even say sorry, guide us and Quran being the last of all this guidance and Muhammad being last of all these prophets and messengers. So I you know, invite you to read upon this and you will see that your heart and your mind will agree with both. I appreciate your chat. What is your name, man? Mansoor. And yours? Richard. Richard, nice talking to you. I, I, listen, I've, I've enjoyed the chat. It's interesting. It's, it's okay. It's thoughtful, you know. Thank you. Thank you. All right, have a good afternoon. You too, thank you.